Valtteri Bottas has become Formula One's invisible man in the season's second half, with just one point for the Alfa Romeo driver since Canada in June, and three retirements from the last seven races. It's been a tough run for the Finnish pilot, who was a star performer at the dawn of F1's new era, care of a robust Ferrari-powered C42, with points in seven of the first nine races. But Bottas went into the project direct from Mercedes with open eyes and a calm keenness to raise his game across the board. As a driver, I think you never, never stop learning as long as you want to. So, of course, I'm always looking at areas that I can be better. And it truly feels like now I can just, you know, be the best version of, of myself instead of trying to be, you know, something else and trying too hard. The team, though, will need to try hard to stay ahead of Aston Martin, just four points between them ahead of Brazil, in the fight for sixth in the Constructors, which would be Sauber's best result since 2012. It will need to make the most of its final upgrades for the season, with its new front wing that arrived in Japan and floor in Austin. Of course, Bottas can also provide solid direction, having been a big part of the Silver Arrows juggernaut, where he netted 10 wins a key reason why he was sought out by Alfa Romeo in the first place, world championship winning calibre Intel. For sure, you know, I've been inside a team that uh, knows how to win, what it really takes in terms of the teamwork, uh, in, in terms of the uh, machinery and um, how you work. And um, I think with the, with the team spirit, I've learned so much that actually if you can get the spirit up, it, it really boosts uh, the performance in every area. Bottas also has form in these final two races, with 2017 his best showing in Brazil and Abu Dhabi, with second and a win respectively. Last season, Bottas was on pole at Interlagos and finished third. Regardless, the focus is already on next season back at its Hinville base, and with Bottas there until 2025, and keen to remain when the squad becomes Audi, the stability is there for improvement with the right mindset from the outset. In the end, we're in, in this together with, uh, with Guan Yu and with the whole team and, and with Robert as well. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.